how to add a gradient to the swatches panel in Illustrator. First thing to do, go over here and select a path. Then go to the gradients tool, select the gradient tool there, and also you'll need some panels. So window, gradient, and swatches. So with those, what you can do, go over here to the gradient and simply go to here. Select that one, linear, and you can now see the gradient. Now I don't want to save that one, that already exists in there. So I'm just going to quickly go over here and you can see that white dot there, select that and I can change the colour. Just go to swatches, just use some of these colours here. So select red and if you hover just below that line you can see a plus appears. Click there and then you can add another colour. These are stops. So you can go again, another stop there, go down there just below, you see a plus again and also you can colour it as well. So if you want to you can always change the colour. So if you decide, you know what, I don't want blue there or I don't want that position, I can move it. And also you can mod modify the midpoints as well. So you can make that more black or more blue. So you just move that, that just little dot there can just be moved. You can change that gradient stop, maybe to green. Now once you've done that, you see over here, you've got the colour there, green. I don't want it that. I want it to go to the gradient. So simply select the selection tool. Now with that selected, you can see now the gradient's there. Super useful because what you can do, go over to swatches and you can see exactly the same there. You can go to the right side menu and you can go to new swatch. So select that and then give it a name. Well, I'm just going to go with new gradient swatch and you can see now it's been added there. But also what you can do, you can go and use the wonderful edit menu and just go down to edit colours and recolor artwork. When you go into that you've got a whole range of colours that you can use. So you can manipulate the colour in all kinds of ways and as you do that as you move this around, change these, you can see the colours change here in the gradient, but also it immediately adds a swatch over here. So now escape and you've got your new design there. Well, if you want to go and do it again, you can always go back to edit and then edit colours and recolour artwork and you can do exactly the same. So you can just move it around and you can see straight away another one's added. And you can tweak it to your heart's content, creating all kinds of amazing colourful designs and then you can see straight away it's been saved over there to the swatches panel and again press escape to get rid of that panel there you have it a quick way of saving gradients to your swatches panel thank you much